last time we were discussing Mr. Harding and the problem with his wife, and I think we were making a lot of progress. So who would like to begin today? Mr. McMurphy? Yeah. I've been uh, thinking about what you said about, uh, <clears throat> you know, getting things off your chest. And, uh, uh, <clears throat> well, there's a couple of things that I, I'd like to get off my chest. Well, that's very good, Mr. McMurphy. Go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> Today, as you may or may not know, it doesn't matter, is the opening of the World Series. What I'd like to suggest is that we change the work detail tonight so that we can watch the ball game. Well, Mr. McMurphy, what you're asking is that we change a very carefully worked out schedule. A little change never hurt, huh? A little variety? Well, it's not necessarily true, Mr. McMurphy. You know, some men on the war take a long, long time to get used to the schedule change it now and they might find it very disturbing oh, fuck the schedule i mean they can go back to the schedule after the series i'm talking about the world series nurse Reggie. <laughs> huh? well anyway this is no way to proceed about this how would it be if we had a vote and let majority rule great let's vote on her so all those in favor raise your hand Okay, guys, come on. Put your hands up. What's the matter with you? Do you want to watch the World Series? Come on, get your hands up to give, do you some good to get some exercise, putting your arms up in the air. That's it. Come on, let's... What is this crap? I mean, I am. I watch the series. I watch. I haven't missed the series in years. Even in the cooler, when I'm in the cooler, they run in there. They have a riot. What's the matter with you guys? Come on, be good Americans. Well, Mr. McMurphy, I only count three votes, and that's not enough to change ward policy. I'm sorry. Touch me once more. Game, Hardy. Trust me once more. Oh, Jesus. Is that what your schedule does for you, Hard on? <laughs> Damn lunatic. No. Well, then stay all wet, Harding, huh? Because I'm going downtown and watch the World Series anyway. Anybody want to come with me? I do, Mac. I want to go with you. Chez, all right. Anybody else? Where? Any bar downtown. Mac, 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 you can't, 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 can't get out of here. Anybody want to bet? Hmm? Chicken shits? Never he'll just show Nurse Ratchet his big thing and she'll open the door for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I will. And then maybe I'll just use your thick skull and knock a hole in the wall. See? Felt? See? <laughs> <laughs> Why, my head would squash like an eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck Seafelt's head. I don't need Seafelt's head. I'm gonna take this fucking thing, I'm gonna put it through the window, and me and my buddy Cheswick are gonna go out through the hall, downtown, sit down in a bar, wet our whistles, and watch the ball game. And that's the bet. Now, does anybody want any of it? Huh? You're gonna lift that thing? Yeah. That's right. I'll bet a buck. Tabor, one dollar. I bet a dime. Yeah, you can't. I can't li li lift that thing. Anybody else want any of it? Hard on? Mm -hmm. I'll bet $25. $25. 
part of it. Mac? You Mac? No, it. no, no, nobody could ever, ever. Lift that thing. Get out of my way, son. You're using my oxygen, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Given up? No. Just warming up. Warming up. I tried, didn't I? God damn it. At least I did that. <laughs> 